Now to this story. Trapped in Taiwan, a UW-Milwaukee student had an unexpected medical emergency while traveling abroad. And his parents say he's not allowed to leave the country, but they're fighting to get him back home. We feel hopeless. We feel that there's no way out. Christopher Boggs says he and his family don't know where to turn for help. He says his son Ryan was studying abroad in Taiwan when he suffered a nervous breakdown and had an altercation with a police officer. Boggs says Ryan is currently in police custody and is being told he cannot leave the country unless his legal issues are resolved. My attorney is implied that if court fees and fines are not paid, that the normal process would be uh, jail time. The family says their attorney in Taiwan told them those fees and fines could be as much as $14,000. They're hoping to get more information during a court hearing scheduled for Monday. Box says they are struggling to raise the money and they've reached out to Wisconsin lawmakers and the State Department, but so far they have not received any help. And we can't understand why uh, Taiwan or why the U.S. government can't get involved and can't get my son home. Now, today's TMJ4 reached out to the U.S. Department of State. A spokesperson says the department is aware of reports of an incident involving a U.S. citizen in Taiwan, and they take their obligation to help U.S. citizens overseas seriously. But because of privacy considerations, they cannot comment any further. We'll let you know how that resolves itself. We also contacted UW in Milwaukee to learn the university is working with the family to see how they can be of assistance. I understand the parents' frustration. Well, coming up